What's up, everybody? Welcome to Vertachi's Couch Main Gaming YouTube channel. And I'm here to make another one of these tier lists, but this not gonna be your average tier list, your everyday tier list, just to make a tier list and rank characters. I already did that. I gave that to you the last video. Some of the stuff I said, like in my last tier list video, some of the stuff I said, it's out the door now. It's, and, and then all switched up. But either way, I'm here to help make a team with this tier list. So how I'm gonna order this, it's not just gonna be based off of, you know, straight A, B, C, D, cause everybody's almost the same. Everybody's almost A, S, A, or B. You know, everybody's pretty close. What I'm here to create this time is where they should be ranked and where you should hold them on your team at and put them in a tier on how good they are in that position by giving them positions, point guards, shooting guards, centers, small forwards, and power forwards, okay? All right, because Broly's the best center in the game right now, just letting you know. Broly the best center in the game. Like He could be an anchor for you. He could be a point guard for you. But this boy is a center, gold gold right there that's where that boy needs to be and he needs to stay there in the center because if you lose your point you want to be going to broly and if you lose broly i hope your anchor is good enough but usually you would just switch them out because once you're down to your last two characters you know you're going in and out trying to preserve life as much as possible but this is number one right here for your number one center in the game this is the best you know he got passing skills he got ball handling skills he can get the rebound he can grab somebody he don't care like he'll grab you at the rim he'll dunk you he can do all of those things he can do all those things all right so this is how i'm going to do this it's to make it a little bit more fun your point guards obviously your starting characters who you want to be on point your shooting guards are they work good as point and centers like you know you could have them as a point or a center but I'm trying to put them where they are strongest at in the game and where you get the most out of them at. Not just like put them there and they're going to do the most there. No, where you get the most out of your buck for Broly is at center. That's where you get the most out of him. Where you get the most out of Gotenks is at anchor. I'm the, I'm the, my bad. I play Gotenks at anchor, but that's only because I run two point guards. It, it's kind of different if you're running two centers or you're running two anchors or you're running two point guards or you're running three point guards it don't matter how you sw switch it up or anything i'm just trying to put them based off of where they're at um is this the number one point guard in the game uh gotenks is highly a very good point guard he's, he's a very good point guard he can open you up he can get the combos and he can get the damage out now this this dude is the this to do is a hell of a point guard. We're going to definitely go ahead and put Piccolo as the best center. Second best center in the game because Piccolo just works best as center. You know, most people, they don't even play. It was playing him as point a lot in season two and everything, but we just switched up. And Piccolo mainly is a center now or an anchor, but he's really, he's really a center because you're usually bringing him out second anytime you got him on a team. Uh, Ginyu, he gonna be he gonna be a top he gonna be a top spot. I haven't I'm not gonna order this yet until I really look at it. Point guard, point blank, opens you up. He's like a can opener. He's gonna go for you. He's getting in your face, and he got ball dribbling skills. He got ankle breaking skills. He will break your ankle. That's another thing about Ghost Tanks. He will break your ankle. The better they break your ankle, the better they are at being a point guard. The more they break your ankles, and these characters. They, they small. They're going to break your ankle. Um, I mean, this is obviously a good anchor right here. Some of these, I've, been, I've been th already thought about it and everything. They're best placing. Uh, 18, simple. She's an amazing. She's amazing on point or she's an amazing center to help you because she has a great assist to be a good center. That's another thing about being a center or being in the shooting guard position here. They make really, they make really good, they make really good point guards are centers in the game basically you could basically have see right here he probably the best shooting guard in the game because he's really good at being point but he's also really good at being center because his assists are amazing with him having such a good assist it makes him for an amazing position um, um android 18 i mean i meant 21 
I don't know how I feel about her being point right now. Broly's obviously a good shooting guard. He's uh, Cell is obviously a good shooting guard. Cell probably right here. Because I feel like Ginyu deserves more of being almost top tier and best in his position. Because if you're going to play him on point, you wreck his shit. And if, if you can get started. And if you play him on center, you know, you're trying to get his sh shenanigans out fast as possible. Uh... Psh Gohan, but he's really one of the worst. Really one of the worst. Frieza, I'm gonna go ahead and put him as a small forward, but he not he not the best small forward. He not the best. He not the best. He ain't the best anchor either. It's this is I'm trying to put them at the end because I know some of these people where they deserve to be. Ooh, ooh, anchor, anchor, big time, big time, oh, big time anchor. Big time anchor. These are anchor boys right here. Do extreme damage on the output. I would say, I would put, I would put, I would put GT Goku here definitely as anchor. Be second best at being an anchor because he can just shit out damage and his dude. He can, he can spear bomb you into level one. You that is ridiculous. That is just ridiculous. Obviously a good point guard. Probably best at being point guard. Best at being point guard. Is Yamcha best at being an anchor anymore? He was the number one anchor for the long in season season two and season one. Yeah, he's pretty much the best anchor in the game. But right now, it's not it's not so much like that. Uh, Nappa is definitely not. Definitely, Nappa is definitely a shooting guard. Cause you really need him on point, or you need him on center. You can't have him on anchor. He ain't his mix up is trash. It can't be no. It can't be that. As, I think it's shooting guard position is probably the most position in the game. Probably one of the worst anchors. Uh, Goku Black. I hate to put so many in shooting guard position. Jiren, Jiren definitely a shooting guard because you could put him as a point guard and he makes a good point guard, but his assist is really fucking good. So actually, the higher I put them up here, the better they are, of course, in their position. But the the higher they are, the better they are at also being a point guard, obviously. Who else makes good centers? Uh, Vegeta does not make a good anchor. I, I mean, he's an okay anchor. So he's probably the best small forward in the game. I ain't gonna lie. Probably the best small forward. We're gonna go ahead and go ahead and put Roshi. Roshi is... Roshi is center, you know, he, he is center. Why? Because his assists are really good. It's no reason to really put him out there on point. Like, you can, but there's no real reason to actually do it. Krillin is obviously, obviously going to be. It's Cell, it's, you know, Cell combo game then got stupid again, so Cell deserves to be there. Videl is obviously supposed to be a point guard, but she's going to be the worst one in this division. Beers is supposed to be a point guard, but he's not a point guard. Uh, Gohan, 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 he, he still got combo potential out this world, but I, I just don't see it. Blue Vegeta, oh, point guard now. One of the best damn point guards in the game now. That screen control he got, ridiculous. It's probably your worst center right here. Majin Buu, I think Majin Buu is best center, like, he can be a shooting guard because he can be your point, but I feel like he's just best at being at being a center. 17's a point because Zamasol's a point. In my opinion, they're like they're not the best points, and they can totally be centers, and they work fine as centers. But they really need. It's the same case for Napa. They really need as much assists as as possible they need to be able to pass the ball they need to be able to pass the ball get the ball out of their hand real quick and then bring it back to their hand but you know they're not the the worst at being point well, they are the worst at being point gogeta definitely point he probably he probably the worst point videl is probably the worst point actually but because you you need videl to be point i would never tell you not to put videl on point i should probably put videl on point because i would never tell anyone not to play videl on point because you just hurting yourself Cause if your point die and you still got Videl, good luck, good luck. See, this is a fast tier list. Cause we only we only gotta put people in a position where they where they're gonna need to be. You know, Kefla. Oh, she's 
she's a shooting guard. See, the shooting guard gonna have the most position, which is it's basically like any tier list. It's actually not like any tier list. Let me not say that. <laughs> we got a point guard. Uh, you see, Goku, you you want him to be the point guard. You want him to be the point guard. He isn't the best point guard, but. You know, he can handle himself. He can pass the ball real nice. Kefla's obviously not here. Kefla's gonna be probably, I would say Kefla's there. I think all these characters are better than Kefla. I ain't gonna lie. Even though Kefla has some stupid stuff that stop her, stop things from happening, but you definitely want her. See, she, you don't, you could play her on point, but you definitely want her as your center. So that's why she's here, because she's further closer to being a better center. Because you want her assist to come out for you. Her assist is really good. Uh, I really hate to put Majin Buu here. I, I really feel like he could be a point too. I just hate filling up the shooting guard position so much. It's going to be hard for you to draft. Because we got a lot of shooting guards out there. Not that many centers. Uh, hit. Uh, we all know hit make a good point guard. We all know that. Mmm, I'm gonna put him about right there. Vegito, small forward. He's probably better than he's probably better than Goku Black. Frieza combo potential is hard, but zoning potential is stupid. Janemba gonna go ahead and Janemba gonna be Janemba got a command grab, but it's not the fastest, but it is decent enough. So he gonna go ahead and be a good center. And Cooler is going to be a center. Uh, yeah, he's still the worst center. Now. Well, that's that's definitely an odd tier list. That's, that's definitely an odd tier list. The only reason I put Nappa here is because Nappa mix-up game can get pretty stupid, but you know what? Beerus is actually the worst shooting guard in the game compared to all of these. I ain't gonna lie. Like, Beerus is one of the last options you want. Ultimate Gohan, he just got more sauce than hit, so he probably gonna have to be there at night. That's just how it's gonna have to be. And I think, I think I'm pretty satisfied with that. If I change anything, you know, I could put Majin Buu over here, and Majin Buu would probably take this position but I, I see Majin Buu work out better as a center I just I just always see Majin Buu work out a lot better when he can throw his fat cell on you and just hold you in there for a good assist these are your best anchors in the game pretty much you you can Look, if you play an all-point guard team, of course you're going to have a point guard as an anchor. But naturally going into the game first, and you're looking at the game, and you're going to play the game, and you're trying to structure a team, this is basically what this type of tier list is. I'm saying these characters are obviously, are, these three characters are way better than these four characters. These characters are almost all even, but these four are definitely way better than these two. Uh, Gotenks and Gohan are not better than, you know, these, these are interchangeable. These are interchangeable right now. We don't, we don't know for sure. But we do know these are, these are the top point guards in the game. Definitely these five, six. Yeah, definitely these six. We, that's your top point guards of the game. I can't really order them. But they will open you up. It's your best shooting guard in the game because he can be center or point guard. His assist is so good. It's one of the best assists in the game that create combos. Is that That's why he has to be number one shooting guard. Because that assist will cause you to put him on center. That assist will cause you to put him on center. He would be a good... Broly S. Broly would be a good point guard. And he is a great point guard. I actually think he's that good of a point guard. Matter of fact, you, let's put him back right here. No, let's put him back right here because he can mix. He can mix you up. He can mix you just as much as these four characters can mix you right here. He can really mix you. Jiren can't even really mix you that much. Android is actually better. You know what? Krillin's actually better than Jiren too because he can mix you up better than Jiren can too. Now when they get down to these, 
they almost about even, you know. Once you get that game playing, once you get that game playing rolling, the game play rolling, you know, yeah, they hard to beat. Beer's putting out damage. Napa putting out damage. Napa is, he might hold you in the corner, but you could probably eventually get out. He might be the worst shooting guard in the game. These are too close for me to even really know. Yeah, they're too close for me to even know. You know, his damage output might let him go ahead and go over Napa. Hit. Hit's not the best. But hit, you know, he can. He can count on you. He can count on you. So, that's how I feel. You want to structure a team. I'm saying, all I'm saying is you can look at this and you can basically be like, oh, all those make great points for me. And all these make great centers for me are they could be a point for me it just depends on how you want to play your game plan but this right here is the tier list for you to help choose how good they are in that position and what you want to do with it because actually Yamcha might be better than Trunks in this position not gonna lie Yamcha is probably better I didn't mean to do that Yamcha is probably better because his they combo potential both the same but I think Trunks damage output it's just making him go above Yamcha. But we all know Yamcha. Yamcha the kid. They nerfed his Wolf Fang. You know. They both. Trunks' damage output is really was probably kicking over at Yamcha. But his combo potential is, you know, he make comebacks. Yamcha makes comebacks. And Goku your number one anchor. Go Base Goku your number one anchor right now. You know your boy. SSJ used to be your boy. Number one anchor in the game. But now he's like, you know. Why don't you just do K.O. Ken and Spirit Bomb? You know, he he works so well with so many different teams. Well, with the other top players in the basketball of fighters. Why not? Why not? Why not? He works, he works amazing with literally these five, six, and these two to three. Even the number one over here. You already know, bro. You already know. That's that's it right there. That's it right there. Towards the inner tier list, you know, you probably don't want to use them. But towards the front of the line, you wanna, you probably want to be drafting one of those first. It's your draft list. It's your players. It's their stats. You go in. You go now. You go draft your team. And you go make greatness with your team. Do that. Ritachi is out. Like and subscribe. Please hit the like and subscribe button. Likes help me. You already know that. Everybody know that. You watch YouTube. You watch other YouTube videos. Everybody tell you that. But you can help me. You can help a fellow. Otaku out.